Good day everyone and welcome to Diamond Art Riddell. Today I am kitting up this piece. It is a uh, 40 by 30 from DIY Buying. So I recently unboxed this one on the channel. And it's a quite cute little piece of this lighthouse. It looks really nice, especially for the camera. Uh, I'm really interested to see how all this busy area with the plants and that come up. So hopefully it works up well. I have two keys on this diamond painting and 24 colors. It's looking a really nice and sparkly type of glittery canvas. And yeah, so I've just let it rest for a little while. As I said, I've only recently unboxed it, but I've just been letting it lay flat, pop some uh, books and stuff on it. So I've got a little bit of dirt. That's my fault. I did that. But um, yeah, it's coming along really well. It's like it's flat enough I think to work on and be pretty content so I'm going to be using one of my favorite what do you call it containers to uh, kit up today this is a 28 grid brick basically I don't need all of them I only need a 24 and I just use the labels as you would have seen as so just with the numbers on there so I can reuse these kits and then just put a little tape name of whatever one I'm working on. The drills around in this particular diamond painting. So we're going to start getting them all organized so I can start some work on this. And then I can show you guys what it all looks like. Okay, where's a little bit of scissors? So I'm just going to get these little ones. They're quite handy and they're very sharp. Very, very sharp. So I might just push that up there. I'll just leave it just in shot a bit so you know that I've got, um, well, what diamond painting we're working on today. So how is everyone today? I hope everyone's going really well and help, having a great day. What are you guys working on? Have you got something that you're hoping is going to work out too? <laughs> So this one has quite a substantial amount of colours. Okay, I've got a couple of sixes as well, so I won't worry about taking them all apart. So most of these are fairly full actually, which is really good to see because then I've got plenty of um, plenty of drills. So I'm just taking one to five. Off the strip there as I said just that standard blue with silver stripping and I'm just going to do as anyone would do when they're kidding up just going one by one so what have I got here a nice sort of lilac color I don't know if that's focusing when I do that at all but there we go So yeah, that's really pretty. So what have we got? I've got DMC codes as well for this one. So you have got DMC coding and stuff on the bag as well as the canvas. Let's see if I can pour this in here without spilling them everywhere. I should have got my little vacuum cleaner dude, shouldn't I? Hmm, that would have been smart. And more baggies but I'm just going to put that over there for now so these containers do hold quite a bit there's an old drill in there I don't want that one so I quite like using these so I obviously didn't clean them out real good from last time but they are very handy they're not nice compact little unit and holds a lot of colors 28 colors is quite a good amount I think be able to keep all in one area and I don't know if there's a lot of diamond paintings that I've had to worry about getting two containers 28 is normally pretty well covers most of these uh, what do you call them budget friendly let's go with that type kits and things so three is I don't know what you call that it's a any grey colour, nothing really exciting. One of your neutrals, 
We'll just go with that. It's a neutral. Nice neutral colour. A few of those sort of things in this diamond painting too. Whoa, look out. Told ya. Oh, look at that. Just fits. Awesome. So green is the next little one. So I've been really, really busy lately uh, with the channel for one. And I'll get into a bit of that in a minute. You know, work's been busy, channels keeping me on my toes. <laughs> Kids have been homeschooling because we've had another lockdown. It's lockdown six. So, yeah, I don't know. It just well, seems to just always be something happening around here at the moment. I'm really flat out. Just exhausting. But you keep on trucking because what else can you do? You gotta, you gotta keep going. That's all there is to it, really. Okay, so I'm up to number six now. Six had two, uh, what do you call it, sachets. I'm just gonna cut one off completely and put that over in my pile of uh, spares. And I will open this one instead. They are really full. Look at that. Now get that up and close and personal with you. Oh, no. So yeah, if you can see, it's quite, quite a lot in there. All right, come back. All right, let's trim this one. Gotta be a bit careful because he's so full. Concentrating here. Excuse me while I concentrate on my pulling on my drills because I do that. I do it every time. Still heaps left over in that bag. Number seven. Now, number seven is this little blue color. Easy peasy. So, what's been happening? What's going on? So, homeschool is a thing, but we just found out that we will be going back to face to face tomorrow. So, that is awesome. We've probably been up actually face to face for a couple of days by the time I upload this video, but on time of recording, uh, yeah, it's tomorrow basically. We go back to face-to-face -to -face learning, which is going to be good. Although I think the kids have adapted well to it all. You know, it's a little bit different sort of setup, but they have been doing pretty well, I reckon, adapting to doing the online, you know, video calls and trying to find their work on the on the program so you know i think they've done a really good job they're trying their best it's, whoa that's all you can really ask and i've been getting and the and the school's been really good keeping up with the communication so you know where you are and i think that helps a lot too that i've had had that going on that was really good we've had pretty good communication let me know uh you know just anything from well this task is due updates to what's happening or even which was really nice is they send a little thing saying you know your son slash daughter has done you know contributed well today and we thank you for their efforts you know it's nice that sort of thing so there's that that's what's been really um positive for me out of this whole homeschool situation but yeah it's 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 good it's done hopefully we don't have to do it again too soon because I do think, you know, they miss their friends and all that sort of environment. That's really good for them. But yeah, so there they go. It's all a big change. Everyone's got to adapt to these changes. So that's pretty much keeping me busy. Work's just busy. 
<laughs> that doesn't stop being busy. So you juggle that in between. Um, and then things are happening a real lot lately for the channel, which is awesome. Um, that's exciting. This is my fun. This is my, uh, you know, this is the joy of my life is having my YouTube channel and working on my diamond paintings and sharing with you guys and all that. This is, this is my, you know, therapy to life. You know, what, what makes all that, you know, when you're having a big day at work, oh, well, I can go do some diamond painting and I could make a video. That's fun. That's good. You've got to have that outlet. You've got to have uh, something that you enjoy doing. It doesn't matter what it is. For me at the moment, I'm really enjoying dime painting, honestly. Because there was a time there where I did. I've always done some sort of craft. Let's. I'll be honest with you. I've always been crafty, artsy, you know, the whole existence on this planet pretty much from day dot, you know, of one of them kids that always was drawing and had pencils in their hands, etc. Even had Etch-a-Sketch back in the day. Remember Etch-a-Sketches? Who remembers Etch-a-Sketches? Comment in the, down below if in the comment section if you remember Etch-a-Sketch and if you had one. Now, those things were a lot of fun, but really tricky to get a curved line on. But, yeah, that's what I spend my time as a girl. I spend a lot of time on my Etch-a-Sketch, one of my pride and joy pieces of toys slash equipment in my life so yeah always been one of the people that would be doing some sort of crafty artsy thing so there was a stage there i've gone for different things uh did some ceramics and then i did some jewelry making for a long time bead jewelry I still got all that stuff there, so let me know if you want to do one of them one day. I could whip them out of the cupboard, uh, <laughs> dust them off, so to speak. And yeah, so I did that for a very long time and really enjoyed that. Then, yeah, for some reason, I just started working. You know, kids getting busy with them, whatever. I don't know. And I just sort of stopped doing stuff. Couldn't get to markets. They got too, you know, hard. So, yeah, then I just sort of stopped and I was really looking for something and it was quite a long time. And this came along. Diamond painting came into, into the world. And I saw a couple of ads, as you do, you know, you see things pop up on your Facebook or whatever. Yeah, so... Um, yeah, I thought that was really interesting. So I was just about to have a crack at it. I was going to say, where the heck did 19 go? That's such a mess going on here. Hang on, let me get myself much remuddled. Check all this rubbish up that end. Um, so, yeah. So I sort of seen the ads and, you know, pop up and then I actually seen someone I knew and they had one on the kitchen table. Went, oh, what's all that? Oh, that's those diamond paintings. Oh, and she had diamond dots. And um, I went, oh, let me have a look. So I checked it all out. And that's why, yep, I'm getting a kit. That was that. I'm definitely getting one of these kits. Got my head around it all. Started doing it. And just kept on doing it. <laughs> Now I own God knows how many kits. I've done, don't know how many kits. Just love it. So much fun. It's really satisfying to, to, to finish one of these. I really feel very accomplished when I've actually finished diamond painting. So hmm, I like it. And you, I've got some really pretty things that hang on the wall. Very, very exciting stuff. And exciting stuff is coming to the channel. So if you haven't already, hit that notification bell so you know when I upload next on the channel. There is coming up some new companies. Um, more have been emailing me and asking me to do some unboxings and I will do some product reviews and workups and kit-ups. I will be doing some more of those videos when I get a chance to. 
but at the moment i have got some unboxings coming your way so keep your eye out on your ear out or whatever a bit out for those because there will be some different uh, e-commerce store type places that i will be showing you some of their goodies from there you go that's a big announcement isn't it i suppose Ooh, I had an announcement. Sounds exciting. Sounds a bit professional. Wow. Anyway, um, so yeah, keep your eyes out. We'll go with eyes. Eyes and ears out. Uh, hit that notification bell if you haven't already. Subscribe. All that good stuff. And then you should be right if you haven't done already. And for those who already have done all those great things, Thank you so much. You are awesome. You are the guys that I keep on doing this for. And because I love diamond paint. But, yeah. So there we go. That is the 24 colours. I've already gone through and kitted all them up. This is ready to rock and roll. Looking forward to working this one up. And I will bring it back to the channel. And we will have a bit of a look at it together. I really do hope this works. I love the image. It is so pretty. I love the lighthouse. I really do um, like this one. So uh, wait and see. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Stay tuned for those unboxings. They're coming up around the corner. And I will bring this back as soon as I can. I've got a few on the go at the moment. But, yeah, uh, I will definitely bring in back this one for a quick review. Till then, be well, be safe, take care of each other, and be your life beautiful diamond art. This is Del signing out. Have a wonderful day, guys. And thank you so much for watching. Bye now.